This exercise is Laboratory 6. It deals with immune tissue and immune organs. This first organ is the lymph node. The lymph node is an oval structure and uh, as we scan down the length uh, we'll come to the opposite end here and the opposite end is the hilum or hilus and it has arteries and veins and it has nerves associated with this organ. The node is surrounded by a, a dense connective tissue capsule and uh, immediately under that capsule is a space and if we go to a higher power to look at that space we'll see that uh, this is an uh, area where the lymph fluid can circulate. The uh, outer portion of the lymph node is called the cortex and uh, the cortex would be from this area to this area, that's the cortex. And in the cortex we find these spherical structures, the lymph nodules, and the nodule has a lighter germinal center and a darker corona. In the center with this more open tissue or less dense tissue, uh, this is the medulla and the medulla has these uh, areas of tissue called the medullary cords and the spaces are the medullary sinus again where the lymph fluid can uh, percolate through the organ and the uh, lymph fluid can come in contact with the key cell of the lymph node and that's the lymphocyte and the lymphocyte has the appearance of a dark blue dot because the cytoplasm is not easily seen, it's small and uh, the nucleus is very prominent. 